The teams then, Atletico Madrid against Roma. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? I think Ed and Dzeko is the one to keep an eye on. His game is all about goals, although he does make other contributions, of course, but can he step it up to a ruthless level and be regarded as one of the very best? That's the question we might be asking later. Yes, he's certainly the one who carries the hopes of his team. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Looks to thread it through. Done very well to intervene. Checo. And it's Camero. Griezmann. That's gone a long way up and away. Shell pass, that's the message there. Griezmann gets his foot in there. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Perotti. Oh, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Jekko tries to head towards goal. Griezmann, can he get through? Federico Fazio. Manolas pumps it upfield. Pumps it forwards. Can he find a finish now? Looking to force his way through. Manolas. De Rossi. And we've reached half-time. Reflections on the first half? Well, the manager's surely got to look for one or two creative changes now. They need some service up front. And a grossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. Start of another 45 minutes. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone could step up and produce something a little more magical. A great save, real class. Uh, much more than a than a routine save for me, and, and yet he just coped with, with room to spare. Defence can get it clear. Juan Fran passes it through. Keeper's ball. Florenzi. Nainggolan. Gamero sticks in a foot to win it back. Tries lifting it over. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to 
open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Roma look as though they're about to make a change. <laughs> Federico Fazio. That's good progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Juan Fran. Goes for the cross. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. Florenzi. Federico Fazio. Very few chances to talk of, Jim. Defence is, it seems, on top here. Yes, nil-nil and little promise of a goal due to the shot-shy nature of this contest, but I'm not giving up on it. There's plenty of energy on the pitch not to give up hope just yet. And that's another throw. And it's Jekko. Koke. Away from immediate danger. Felipe hits it first time. Oh, just couldn't quite turn it in. Roma didn't really deal with the wide play. It was a, a lovely dribble down the flank, but really they've got to double up to try and stop that. And I think with the attempted goal too, they were a little fortunate. Final five minutes. Griezmann with the foul. Out to the left it goes. Thrust towards the front line. Well positioned to make that interception. Long and high towards the flank. Florenzi looking to get on the end of this. Atletico Madrid have a sub ready to come on. Okay. Spoon forward. It's the route one option. There is the final whistle. A frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defense is broadly in charge, and it has finished goalless. So, what do you take away from it all, Jim? Listen, the more this game went on, a draw was always likely to be on the card. So, overall, I don't think anyone will be complaining too much about what they've got. And all that remains for me is to thank Jim Beglin. That's it from us tonight. A very good evening to one and all.